Hello everyone, welcome to Atlassian Jira training. In this training, I'm going to cover Atlassian Jira for software development teams. So if you are a tester or a developer or a scrum master or a project manager within an agile software development team, there is something for you in this particular training. So before we get into the details of the training, let me introduce myself and then I'll also cover what are the core key contents that I have covered in this particular training. So let's get started. So the first thing is that I have been using Jira for more than six plus years now. And when I say using Jira, I'm not been just a end user of the Jira, but I have been a Jira administrator. So I have been doing the configurations, the workflow schemes and understand the key concepts and details of Jira, how Jira has been implemented and how you can use it to the best of its capability so that it is really helpful within your team and fits as per the requirements of your team. The next thing is that I'm certified Jira project administrator, which is ACP 600 certification. That is uh, Jira project administration into Jira server. So I know how to do the project administration tasks and how to configure or administer Jira for any of the project or for the organization. And I'm also a Atlassian accredited uh, technical sales professional. I have trained more than 30,000 students worldwide. So I have my trainings published on Udemy. Uh, there are a couple of other trainings on other subjects like software testing, test automation, along with the Jira. So uh, all of those trainings, I have 30,000 plus unique enrollments in my courses. And I have also published 450 plus videos on YouTube. So uh, these all videos are free and these are all tutorial series on different topics of software testing, test automation, different test management tools, and also on Jira administration. The next thing is the course contents of this particular course. So I have divided this course into different sections. So the first section is about the introduction to Jira, which covers the basic installation setup, how you can install different plugins and the plugin that I'll be using for test management in this particular course is the Zephyr plugin. So I'll explain the installation of Jira as well as the plugin along with the basic configuration and setup of Jira in this particular section. The next, uh, section is about the test management using Zephyr plugin. So this is mostly for the test engineers or the testers that are working in the team. So how you can use Jira with Zephyr plugin to do the test management. So I've covered how you can write the test cases, execute test cases, and then also searching and reporting of the testing activities. The third part is about the defect management, which is again, for the development team, whether it's a tester or a developer, so how you are going to use Jira to manage defects within Jira. Moving next, we have another section which is advanced search in Jira and JQL. This is the very important uh, topic when we talk about the advanced search because JQL is a really powerful query language or Jira query language that we'll be using to create the advanced search filters and then we'll also understand many advanced JQL search examples in this particular section. The next section is about the reports in Jira. Now Jira provides a lot of out of the box reports which we will cover in this particular section. We will cover what all the reports are available in Jira and then we'll cover these reports in detail. So for example, burn down chart, sprint report, epic report, velocity chart, and many other reports that are available in the Jira out of the box. We'll cover most of them in this particular section as well. The next section is about the scrum and Kanban boards or boards in general. So how you can create the board in Jira, Scrum or Kanban board, what is the significance of Scrum and Kanban board, and then how you can actually configure those boards with the workflows or the underlining workflows that are associated with these boards. So these all topics will be covered about the boards and workflow association with these boards in this particular section. 
Now the next section is the Jira administration section where I have more than 30 plus advanced Jira administration tutorials. These are the bonus lectures. So if you are a scrum master or a Jira project administrator who wants to learn about the Jira administration or the details of Jira administration and how to use Jira within your project, how to customize it, you can utilize all these 30 plus videos which will help you in understanding the Jira administration concept and customize Jira as per your project needs. So that's all about the introduction of this particular Jira course. I hope that you find a lot of useful information that is helpful for you in your project and then you also get a detail or understanding of how to use Jira effectively in your software development team. So if you want to get more details or you want to get more tutorials that are available for free, please visit my YouTube channel, RCV Academy and Software Testing Mentor, where I have published a lot of tutorials on software testing, test automation, for example, Selenium Automation Robot uh, Framework, and then also a lot of tutorials on Jira administration, Jira, and then other testing tools as well. So that's all for the introduction. Hope you like this training. See you in the class. Thank you.